Hey everyone, it's Stellar Steel, and welcome back to another episode of Luigi's Mansion. Last time, we learned that Mario is still alive, but as Madame Clairvoya said, his presence was hard to locate because he was actually transformed into a painting. Well, stuffed into a painting, whatever. Hmm. Of course he did that because it's probably a reference to Super Mario 64 DS. I would say probably the canon really for that kind of game is Super Mario 64 DS causes those problems. He's thinking, oh, since you decided to cause all this trouble for Bowser and I, we're going to stuff you in a painting. I know, it feels so humiliating doing that, but... Yeah, anyways, though, this time I said we we're going to return that letter we had of Mario, so let's go do that and see what kind of exorcism we can fork up now from Madame Clairvoya. All right. Mario. Mm, what is this object you have here? Show it to me, please, to Madame Clairvoya. What is this? If, if it isn't Mario's letter, give it to me. I will read it at once. Mm, it's okay. I'm, I'm a licensed letter reader. <laughs> wow. All right. Mm, let's see here. It says L O O K O U T F O R B O O S L U I G I. Hmm, is that all? Not a novelist, you're Mario. This has been written in quite a hurry. Sorry, I read that. I know it's just a couple of booze. Oh, they come. Now the spirits come. Come, spirits of power. Come, spirits of sight. Show to me that awful things that occur here tonight. Crystal orb, symbol of my clan. Use your darkling power to show us all you could. I mean, can. Show us all you can. Show us this, Mario. The light of the spirits, come. Show us what you seek. Oh, hmm, your Mario is imprisoned, but where? Oh, where is he being held? Yes, a painting, your Mario is being imprisoned. Wow, that's really helpful, yes, I know. Yeah, it's like not like we just saw that, that's for sure. Oh, wow, that was so useful. I know, that was, that was a pretty bad hint, in all honesty. Mm -hmm. I do hope that's fixed in the remake. I, I've only gotten a decent, a small distance uh, in the remake, but I will be recovering every single thing, the difference between the remake and this game, in an, in a bonus episode, I didn't really I, I really want to do that because this game de deserves you know definitely special attention that's for sure. All right, what am I doing? All right, so that key I don't think we actually need to go to this room. I think this is the first option room because um we just all we get is money. Look at the second floor. I think there is one room unlocked. Uh... Uh, I, I don't know. Doesn't look like it. That's weird. I guess let's just keep trucking forward. I guess this is required. Never mind then. Uh, I don't know. I still have a sinking suspicion. So if we go into here, this is another interesting area I find as well. I know. We're doing this little animation. Careful, Luigi! Because we're just like thumb moved. We have a parlor. Billiards room. This, this guy is gonna go around do his little stance. You know, this is um, slim bank shot. Pretty cool. I, I, I'm not really a, a huge. Eh. I mean, I do have an uncle that owns a pool table, and my college actually has a pool uh, place as well. Uh, crap, doing that wrong. Get one of these balls, bounce it at him. I think I actually need to get three at once, and then he'll he'll be uh, stunnable. Kind of mean to throw uh, billiards balls to someone like this, you know, someone as skinny as him. You think that would like really hurt? I mean, I could see hitting someone with a like a punching bag, like a uh, Biff Atlas. But holy crap, shooting these like plastic balls! I know he's a ghost and all, doesn't really feel anything, but wow, that's uh, a bit too much, my in my uh, for me. Jeez, almost messed up again. I'm not sure if uh, this guy should be pretty easy. I mean, it's supposed to be pretty easy if I don't. How did? Uh, sometimes I have... That is one complaint I do have with this, is it's kind of hard to juggle. You're trying to like, constantly move back this tick. I don't know, it does suck with this guy, because you got to hit him three times, and then... Blup, he only makes three balls as well, so... Yeah, up. Oh, well, um, never mind then. That was a bit easier than I... Okay, don't, don't jinx yourself now. Frick! Mess me up. I thought it was just like Dark Moon, just hold the d direction. You actually have to pull back, and I. Ah, I kind of wish I was being such an idiot. I guess we're just waiting now for him to line himself up so I could just rob him blind of his money. You know, I don't mind pool. It seems pretty cool. I'm also enjoying the. Uh, 
What the frick? I was thinking about I was doing the Nitro store last time, but... There's a lot of games I didn't really- I haven't really played a ton of them. I am glad that uh, they added that in. Why am I sucking so bad? Pun in- pun- I don't know. I, I just find it kind of strange how people say like pun not intended, pun intended. I just don't- oh, chess. I didn't actually know that was there. Um, I've never actually- I just wanted, one time was going to get into a chess club because my mom was like, you should be in a club of some sorts in your school. Well, um, yeah, it didn't really, really didn't work out because a lot of people- they're very discriminatory. Yeah, not really the word. They're very biased, my school is, I'll say that. Finally, I know that sucked, but whatever, man, that's a bronze for sure. Wow. That blue, and yet again, the strange mirror-like images. Alright, um... <laughs> I'm boohoo. I mean, that's how I feel after failing so miserably at this portrait ghost. Get in my suckage! Who? I just love doing that, like spinning my. Con I, I would do that when I played this game when I was younger. I would just spin my game controller and just like flip, and then yes, we know about elements, triangle relationships. Yes, yes, yes. Just like yeah, 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 yeah. yeah I know it's it's so cool. Just like Pokemon, fire, grass, water. Except instead of grass, we have ice. So I never understood why they they made like they made a. Uh, the Jolteon instead of like a Glaceon early on. I think there was an early concept. In fact, that also uh, Umbreon it's supposed to be a poison type as well. This is optional, yeah, because there's a bunch of money that flies out, and I believe the room to the right actually is unlocked, so I was right about this guy being optional. You don't have to do it if you don't really want to. Let's say you're trying to speed run the game, trying to get the, the, you know, the game done fast or something, but I'm going to do that because, you know, there is a bit of 100% involved in this game, and there's, it's a bit harder to 100% the game. I would say in the new one, there's a much more harder percentage because you actually try to get all the ranks of the mansion. Oh, man, that's being a bit spoiler. Anyways, I'll, I'll shut up for a little bit. It's a bit interesting. I think this is going to... Check your room. It was going to fly open and mess me up. This is this is interesting room. The, the ghost's in here. You can't see him until you hit this thing. Turns on. And these ghosts appear. Yeah! I know, there we go again. Uh, so just realize there's purple, white, and red variations. Uh, the red ones, I think, are the worst. I don't know, but at least you can see their shadows in the projector. Well, you're supposed to be able to see their shadows, anyways. I mean, I really hope they... I really am happy about the uh, Pokemon Go stuff they added for the Sinnoh region. I'm just so hyped because I am. I, a lot of some people don't want Sinnoh remakes. Freaking bloody, bloody! I did not mean to say that. Sorry about that, uh, England viewers. Anyways, um, I am just the Sinnoh. Ma why is? Why are these ghosts dragging me so bad? I just want to try to strike up a con conversation. That's what you're gonna keep doing is messing me over. Stop! Holy! Why? I don't remember there being this many ghosts in here. Holy crap! Wow. Projector is just—it is useless. You can't even see these guys half the time. Wow, this is—I didn't know. I did not remember these ghosts being this nasty. Just uh, also, if you pull on this, you can't suck it up. It'll just—yep, another giant, very smashed. Image. And I like how the eyes are just one's yellow, one's blue, or white. I don't know. I am kind of colorblind, so that looks kind of looks blue to me. Okay, we're gonna have this debate in the comment section. Is that eye white or blue? Uh, reminds me of a very stupid thing people were making a trend of all over the place. I wonder what like the trends are right now. A lot of people were into like trends of like, dare I say, fidget spinners, and then you could say Fortnite as well. I mean, I don't know. Anyways, let's not talk about that stuff. Keep on Mario's glove. Ew, it's a little sweaty. So this is a very strange how there's these items, yet we saw Mario's cap on him. I don't understand this. I don't. I feel like not enough people question the fact that how Mario's in that painting. It's almost as if you could say Luigi's going like through like some sort of like purgatory of sorts. Eh, eh, eh. No, I know someone's just very bad case for me. Anyways, let's go talk to Madame Clairvoy and do a second item. Hopefully, your your um, premonitions of Mario are a bit better than what you just had the last time with your. Very, very bad one. Something we already knew about him being in a painting. Pretty sure my kid self also agreed as well. That one was pretty stupid. Come on. Gonna be like right in front of the stupid crystal ball. Do -do 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 -do. I like that jingle. Mario. No, Mario's not there. That's Madame Clairvoya. Hmm, what is this object? Yes. What is this? It is Mario's glove. Aha. Still damp with the sweat of the living. 
Oh, they come. Now the spirits come. Yes, the spirits of sight. Show us all that comes off for here tonight. Chris Orb, serve my clan. Use your directly power. Show us what you could. I mean, can. Show us all you can. Show us this Mario. This is the light of the spirits. Come. Show us what we seek. Listen, can you hear it? The inner voice of your sweet, beloved Mario. Oh, whores. What is this? A king? King Boo? What is this King Boo? I didn't understand, but what he means, but beware of King Boo. This is what your brother wishes to say to you. Oh yes, a King Boo wears a crown. I see this is King Boo. So, he is the one who has captured your Mario. I can show no more win. Yet again, another useless premonition besides the fact that Mario... At least he had a mission... I really tell you... Us ...of something beyond the grave. That actually made me jump. I did not expect to see that. I can still hear that. And just... Oh, it's like if you look at Luigi's face, like it looks like there's like a second model of his mustache clipping through his face. I don't know if that's the way I'm recording or what. It just looks like really weird, and eh, it's probably is the way I'm recording. All right, 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 all right. Where to next? Spinning in circles. We're going to spin through circles through this hallway, and we will not get hurt one bit. Wow, that was actually a very effective strategy. I I should do that more often. I hate those little exploding. So in here is a very strange old woman. This is Nana. If you try to mess with this, she if, if you hit this, as balls of yarns will fall out. If you pick up a ball of yarn, she becomes freaking angry Nana and then freaks out. What the heck? She'll move around and then she'll like shoot knitting circles at you. It's really weird. You gotta hit her a few times, I think with all the balls of yarn. If you take too long, it'll like mess up her pattern, and then you gotta leave the room and then do it again. Freaking, if they wouldn't just move away, get over here, you frick. That is one problem I have. I, I don't really like, care for the portrait ghost to take this. You, know, you gotta use all this freaking ammo and crap. Stop messing with Luigi's. You're like hitting him in the crotch. Stop that. It's time for you to. Die! Uh, okay. Can I actually get a bit another big pearl for once? I know I was sucking miserably. Come on, suck, suck. Actually, no. This time we have to suck not miserably, but in a very good manner. Come on, come on, come on. Yes. There we go. Big pearlage times seven. Ha 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 I'm enjoying myself just way too much there. This should be a key, if I remember correctly. That is. A very much use. Also, I like those uh, three ghosts up there. There actually is some unused ghosts, which I will talk about towards the end of this, but I believe it was in the first room Luigi actually enters in. There's these three ghosts that were shown in a trailer for uh, E3. Uh, maybe it was Space World 2000. And it shows the three ghosts. Uh, those ghosts were supposed to be portrait ghosts of some sort, most likely. Um, I was hoping there would have been money in there, but I guess not. Let's see, uh, did you old people hide money in there? She has like a little shopping bag as well. Stinky, stinky, limb booger. Uh, oh, so that's what it was. She was had she had cheese in that bag. Yeah, I know. Of course, old people like the cheese. I mean, I don't mind cheese. I was saying I don't like cheese, and freaking some loud ass truck goes on by my r road right when I'm saying that too. So that's nice. See that boo just gave up at the end, Luigi. Your reputation is shredding. <laughs> yeah, I know. They just get. It did, it did, blah, 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 blah. I did just give up on that Luigi face. Wow, that sh that Luigi face. Should be in a. I, I'm gonna make that in a mode now. Screw it. That's like, I, I already have a. I thought my game froze from the way those books stopped mo moving, but okay. There's a moly old journal. Of course, I'll read it. A hilarious trick I played today on Miss Petunia. That was that fool in the bathtub. She jumped to the bathtub after I filled it with ice from the freezer. She actually started shivering pretty badly, and I felt a bit guilty for a second. But Miss Petunia is made of solid stuff. She took a hot shower and felt like new again. When she warmed up, she didn't, wasn't even that mad. Nana. Wow, you pervert. Anyways. Uh, I guess that's supposed to be a hint if you don't really know what to do to get a slim bank shot or whatnot. Okay, yeah, there we go. Of course, I know, I know you ghosts were hiding money somewhere in here. And it was, of course, in the lamps, because that's where we always... You know, that, that always is the cost-effective way. Somehow you can just hide money in a lamp for some reason. Uh, I thought, it, yeah, we did get a key, and that's on the... Wait a second. Oh, yeah, it is on the second floor. I was thinking, like, yeah, that's right. We did go up a floor... But, I'm going to say that's it for this episode of Luigi's Mansion, guys. Next time, in Spinning in Circles, 
we will be using that newfound key we got from Nana's room. And actually, yeah, uh, that if, you know, there is a bit of foreshadowing as to what ghosts we're going to deal with. It's actually the, it's it's that one room we didn't have unlocked yet in the area we found uh, Neville, Lydia, and Chauncey. So, and there stops being bugs flying around in my face, and we will actually have some good luck for once. Anyways, though, see you guys next time on Luigi's Mansion. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Ring the bell notification too. Thank you.